Well, trends that captured the world's attention. This is the stuff that you are searching. Google's annual year in search gives us a look at the people, the places, and the topics that sent the world searching this past year. So joining me now to talk about what those were, Google expert trends ex or Google search trends expert, Alex Joseph. Good morning to you. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Yeah, you know, I always think this is so interesting because, you know, you look at the things that make the top list and they certainly are the things that got us talking. And the first thing that people do is Google it to find out more about it. That's right. I mean, I don't know if you were like me, but everybody in my life in January or February, it seemed like was waking up and the first thing they would do is Google Wordle. And that was the number one trending search on Google this year. For those that aren't familiar, it's a small world puzzle game. It was created by a software developer in Brooklyn, and it went viral and so much so that the New York Times actually acquired it. Isn't that something? I mean, you, you'll be out to lunch with someone. And they're like, hold on, let me do my Wordle before we sit down to eat. So I could see why that was so popular. Let's, let's just go through some of these because I think Encanto certainly took the world by storm in several categories. Exactly. And, and that's something that was a surprise for us. When we looked at the top songs of the year, usually we see artists like Lizzo or Taylor Swift, but none of them could hold a candle to Encanto. Uh, we Don't Talk About Bruno was the number one search song this year. And it was so popular that it also made the movie uh, the number one searched movie this year. I mean, you got to admit, We Don't Talk About Bruno is a jam. <laughs> it is a vibe. I mean, the way that they do it, like in a round in some places, I mean, it's just a brilliant, brilliant song. And even Surface Pressure, that was number two for the song. Who would have thought? Yeah, three of the top 10 songs this year were from Encanto. Another surprising song this year was actually Kate Bush's Running Up That Hill, right? So if you uh, were anywhere and you watched Stranger Things, you heard oh, Kate yeah. Bush's famous anthem uh, make a resurgence this year. And so it was the number six top searched song this year in the United States. You know, and also people who made mistakes, because I see Will Smith on here, number two for the most searched person and also actor. So he definitely made that list for um, that bad decision on stage. Yep, it was a slap heard around the world. Uh, both Chris Rock and Will Smith were among the top 10, but others had uh, really great reasons to break the top 10. So, for example, uh, Serena Williams capped yeah. off a incredible career uh, and retired at the U.S. Open this year, and she was our number 10 most searched person. All right. So what do these tell you or what are you thinking for 2023? Do you have any thoughts on what might be trending? We saw a lot of trends around change. Um, for example, people were coming to Google and often do come to Google to look for jobs. And we have some search tools that allow them to see uh, 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 available jobs. And actually, the, the job searches they're looking for the most right now are for remote jobs. Mm -hmm. um, and so we saw that as a big shift in the way that people are looking for jobs. Another thing that's really encouraging, we saw all-time high interest in sustainability. Um, so electric vehicles and the term sustainability are peaking in ways they have never before. And so that's also really encouraging and hopefully a trend that continues into 2023. All right, it's nice to have a resource that gives us lots of options and lots of things to learn about. So we'll definitely be talking to you next year. Thank you so much. Thanks for having me.